So good morning. So today we're carrying on with our money. We're going to be adding some money today. Now you all did so, so well on converting the pence to pound and pound to pence. So today, as I said, we're going to be adding. We're going to be using the skills from yesterday. So you're going to be checking out your work where you'll be adding different things from a menu. So for example, if you had 83p at £2.34, what you need to do and what you must remember to do is to change 83p into pounds. Okay, it's very important that you're adding up um, the same unit of measure. So you, both times you're going to be adding the pounds. So you write the biggest amount on the top, so £2.34, change the 83p into pounds, so 0 0.83, and then you just add as normal. So 4 add 3 is 7, 8 add 3 11, so carry the 1, and 2 add 0 add 1 is 3. It would be £3.17. Another really important point is to make sure the decimal points are all in a row. Can you see they're all in a row? They should be like that the whole time. Okay, so for example, if you had £14.23, add £7.55, can you see here my decimal points are not in a row? So this sum will not work, it will not be correct. What I have to do is I have to put zero seven pounds and then the pence afterwards. And now the sum is set up correctly with the decimal points all in a nice row. Good luck. I hope you enjoy the work. It's quite good fun ordering your own food. And any questions, pop them in the comments box. Thank you.